everyone, this is Archive at 12, and today we have a Jinx rap from uh, Daddy Fat Snaps featuring longest solo ever. And if you've been watching Arcane Season 2, then you might understand exactly how excited I am for this. Um, obviously, this was made while Arc 1 of Season 2 was out. Arc 2 got released last week. Arc 3 gets released today. And I don't know whether or not this takes any of arc two into consideration, but if this is only just the first three episodes of season two, that's going to be wild. OK, there's there's still a lot to unpack just in those first three episodes and more than enough combined with what happened in the previous season to create something very interesting and very magical. And I get the feeling it's DPS. We're going to get that today. Um, Link will be in the description below if you want to watch this, that my commentary, as well as a link to my Patreon, which I have started. I have uh, started reacting to anime episodes over there, including Dr. Stone episode one and Gundam uh, Requiem uh, for Vengeance episode one. Both of those are over there for the one dollar tiers. Uh, Requiem for Vengeance will be more likely moved to the three and five dollar tiers from episode two on. But if you guys want additional reactions similar to what I was doing with the Amazing Digital Circus and you'd like to see that on a platform that will allow me to do so because YouTube will not. YouTube will just flat out ban them. Then go check that out if you like. Uh, but anyway, we're getting back to the music. So without further ado, let's get started. Very interesting that they didn't start that DPS didn't start the video with like his normal, um, you know, intro about turn this up and all the credits and stuff like that. That's that's a that's a new style choice for his videos. Also, wasn't expecting the dubstep. You better pray to God. Oh, there it is. I guess he I guess he wanted to give us a sample of what we were about to experience. Interesting. OK, so Nina Hope and Cam Steady are background vocals on this. Good to know. I'm, it doesn't look like I'm looking for McGuire. <laughs> yeah. Survival of the fittest fight with science, so I had to pull a vial for my critics. So my critics, yeah. I'm gonna ride up in your district. This the under city, you ain't out here dying. It's a privilege. Yeah. I get tired of these bitches, they complaining like we both ain't out here dying for a living. Uh, yeah. Spent my life inside of prison times. I want to end the pain, and I was pain. The guy, the pistol, pistol, got the pain. Price size brought, but I've been a problem child. This chemical imbalance got me volatile. It's hard to see the enemies of engine and dragons down with the crocodiles. You got to crack a skull before you crack a smile. You cast away the basket case. A shallow grave awaits you when you advocate. The jig is up. It's over for this family matters masquerade. You shook my hand, but had a hand grenade. But well, I'ma let it be in your face. Cause when I'm gone, you feel the phantom pain. That has been a solid minute of, well, almost a solid minute, minus the uh, the intro of DBS going completely ham on a cyberpunky type synthwave track. Like the 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 mix and mastering for this have been really really good. The 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 sound choice. Because of the fact that I associate um, League of Legends less with cyberpunk and more with steampunk, the choice of a of what like a cyberpunk style rap is very curious, I guess. But then again, uh, I'm not entirely sure what I would associate steampunk with. So I I don't know. But considering how many vibrant and and I dare I say violent co colors are in arcane um cuz they appear for bits and pieces especially with Jinx with like her delusions with her insanity popping up with like wireframe neon light versions of like caricatures in her brain um they appear and they're so like almost uh intrusive into the visuals of arcane that like, I guess the cyberpunk does make sense 
because a lot of that that's something that's very common with cyber uh, punk stuff is bright neon colored flashes so despite the fact that arcane is more steampunky it has that cyberpunk element so i suppose i could definitely see the design choice for the rap uh it just took me by surprise a little bit because it's not what i would have normally associated off the top of my head with arcane i do think that he is uh He's doing a more generalized Jinx rap like this based on the visuals and based on the context of everything that he's said so far. DPS is focusing primarily on um, like Jinx as a character leading up to the end of arc one of season two. So this clearly isn't taking anything to a, uh, into effect that happened last week. Uh, probably not even taking anything to effect um, what happened at near the end of episode three of season two. Um, I'm not going to say anything, but if you know, you know. So if that's the case, like this is just like a generalized chaos jinx rap, which works. It definitely works. I suppose I was kind of expecting something a little bit more emotional, but we're still only a minute in. There's still plenty of time. But I, I assumed that. That we were going to be getting something more focused i guess on jinx's relationship with vi instead of just having like random uh lines thrown in here or there i assumed that we were going to be getting something more associated with jinx's perspective on vi instead of the entire world but considering that the entire world made jinx who she was and vi was just the last straw it does make sense the city always takes a toll, you better pay the cost Cause either you can play the game or you can pay the part Either you can hunt the prey or you can pay the part But if you end up in my way, you better pay the cost You better pay the cost You better pay the cost Either you can hunt the prey or you can pay the pawn Either you can hunt the prey or you can pay the pawn but if you end up in my way, you better pray to God. Tie that chop on my let it rain. I just spray it like graffiti. My art is not for the frame. I think frame you up. City on notice, mark for the grave. It can all go up like powder. My palm you away, you man. <laughs> <coughs> There's something about that instrumental right there. I it sounds familiar, but I can't put my 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 finger on it. I can't like recognize where it's from. But something about that 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 like i don't know if that's a synthy type piano or or what that is but something about that the tone sounds familiar i don't know the only other um arcane song that i think dps did was his victor song and i've listened to that one quite a bit i don't think that's from his victor song but something about that just sounds familiar and i don't know why but if you end up in my way, you better pray to God. Tied that chop on my let it rain. I just spray it like graffiti. My art is not for the frame. I think frame you up. City on notice, mark for the grave. It can all go up like powder. My palm you away. Imagine all of your family gatherings happen in brain. All the voices in my head blabber, they call me insane. But bad with the temple and had to tell them, watch what you say. I was the run, but every dog got a day. Yeah. I was left behind. Now my home reflection, someone I don't recognize. Then I left with many choices when you left to die. I put my back against the wall so I don't need your intervention. I will catch me if I fall and I will I'm sorry, I, I'm rewinding just a little bit. I didn't realize exactly how DPS was gonna snap on this until right around here. The video is insane, by the way uh reese i think did the video is that what the credit said um yeah reese did the video reese is a madman like this this video is incredible they did a they did a fan fantastic job of of editing this together um and it's just it's just complimented by the way that DPS is rapping. And all of that is complemented by the way that Longo Solo ever created this mix. Like this is, 
although I said that I would never have originally associated uh, like a cyberpunky style synthwave song for Arcane, this fits Jinx's chaos perfectly. Like everything about this fits Jinx to a T. The 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 energy, the vibe, the the random cuts in the video, the the explosiveness of the colors and the visuals uh dps's lyrics like everything about this fits jinx perfectly it's it's quite something to behold now my home reflection someone i don't recognize then i left with many choices when you left to die i put my back against the wall so i don't need your intervention i will catch me if i fall and now i'm dead inside but pain is really most effective when it's weaponized they had no empathy for me why should i empathize i got this demon on my back and i can't exercise i'm trapped inside Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. I like that a lot. I like, I like that a lot. There's so much there that DPS and Longo Solo ever and Reese brought to the table. Everything fit together seamlessly. There is not a single wasted animation, a single wasted scene, a single wasted edit, a single wasted word. A single wasted note. There is there, nothing there was wasted. Everything fit perfectly. I am blown away at how good that was. Just absolutely incredible. But anyway, that's going to be it for me. Thank you for joining me. I am Ark Alpha 12, and I will see you in the next video.